Nestled between Tony Gwynn Drive and Trevor Hoffman Way, this is Petco Park. The show brings you Diamond Dynasty Baseball. It's Charlotte and the San Diego Padres. Here's Trey Turner. Leading off for the Vipers. The shortstop, Trey Turner. The wide to kick the pitch. Swing and a miss. Oh, and we're down. underway from San Diego. Righty to the plate. Fights that one away, and the count remains 0-2. Chris, you Darvish debuted with the Rangers back in 2012. It's been a pretty successful big league career. And a swing and a miss. And now one away. Here's Harper now. The outfield shifted pretty heavily towards right field. And that one hammered. That's back there. And it's caught just in front of the wall. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Lee Lynn, the batter now, as he swings and misses for strike one. The 0 one is outside, and it's a ball and a strike. Yeah, I remember when he came into the league and talking about seven, eight pitches that this guy had, and wow, you're just scratching your head. If you're a hitter, what do you look for? Two down, nobody on. Fouls one off. Two and two. Two outs. This one in the air right field. Angle. As this one sized up, he's got it, and that'll end the inning. We go to the bottom of the first. Stepping in for San Diego, Xander Bogarts. And there's a breaking ball that drops in there. Singing, you know, Xander Bogarts is actually a twin. His twin brother, Jair, signed with the Red Sox initially and played a little bit in the Boston organization. That's pretty cool. Next pitch is downstairs. When former Red Sox scout Mike Lord visited Aruba for a tryout in the summer, swings through it for the K. Couldn't hit the fastball at the knees. And now it's going to be Jake Cronenworth. And that's in there for strike one. That one off the bad part of the bat, just a lazy fly ball. Pulls it in on the run. Two away. That's a really nice play, ranging back into the outfield for that catch. We all know those can be a little oh, tricky, right especially if the wind's swirling around out there. Manny Machado in now, takes ball one off the plate. in the pitch in the air left field Yoshida makes a nice grab at a full back here in San Diego and now here is Corey Jolts the wind of the pitch shot back to the mound and he gloves it tosses the first leadoff man retired here in the second And first offering is fouled off. The line of the pitch. And a base hit on the line. That is good. The first base now it's Alex Bregman. This guy with light tower power. And first offering is fouled off. The pitch. Grounded to third. Could be two. One at second. And that's two. Back here at Petco Park. Now the youngster wants Soto. 
pitch misses inside and that is ball one. There's the swing and a miss. Got him looking. Called strike three and a fastball up in the zone. Now it's Matt Carpenter. That's in for a strike. There's a strike. Man, that pitch was dotted. So much talent on display when this guy's out there on the hill. Swing and a miss, and he got him. Back to back strike. Now here is Hassan Kim. That just misses. Ball one. one and over. Now one and one. Bounce to the right side. The flip to the pitcher covering. That is the inning. So the Padres with a new arm in the mound. Luis Garcia. The pitch. This one popped up. And that one gets down. Fair ball. The leadoff single and the go-ahead run is aboard. No outs. Runner at first. And here's Paul Goldschmidt. Known for his late-inning heroics. Worm burner into the outfield for a knock. Lead runner makes the turn at second. And now runners at the corners. Nobody out. Just a clutch at bat right there. Big time swing when this team really needed it. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. Oh, Harry Ford swings through it for strike one. Lots of pop at the plate. Outfield playing back almost on the warning track. On the ground right side. And that oh. is a big first out. That's what a good sinker is designed to do. Get a guy to roll over a little bit. Hit the ball on the ground. Kill some worms while you're at it. Swing and a high fly ball out there towards left field. And it's off the wall. One runs in. Now the second run is in. And they take a two-run lead. Well, that had bad had a lot of pressure riding on it. So really great job coming through right there. It's got to feel good. Just missed out on a home run right there. But he certainly hit it hard enough. Just didn't have the right launch angle to carry it over the wall. But still an excellent swing of the bat. Steven Wilson takes over on the mound. And that's a big potential run out there at second as he comes in trying to keep the deficit where it is. For the infielders, they got to be thinking about keeping the ball from getting by them into the outfield any way they can. The throw to first. Harper retired. Now it's the second baseman, Lee Lynn. He swings and misses at the first pitch. 0-1. Wilson, in his second season, he features a four-seam fastball. Rudder breaks for third. Up the middle. Fires over to first. And that'll... Welcome back. And here comes the closer, Ryan Presley. And we all know about his slider. It's just filthy, man. And one of the better ones in the game, I'd say. Spin rate's very high, and it just breaks a ton. Strike two. Cuts on it and misses. That's a strikeout. Couldn't catch up to the heater. The batter now is Adam Engel. In there in its own one. Swings and misses. Struck him out. And now it's Austin Nola. That one missed. Next offering is downstairs. At the belt and fires. There's the strike. Now two and one. And fires in a fastball at 95. 
And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. 2 nothing. your final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John Shambi saying so long.